Here's one phenomenon that happens during the death and dying process that medical professionals like myself cannot explain. There's something that happens that we call the rally. When I first started as a doctor, this freaked me out. So one of the patients I was looking after developed severe abdominal pain. We get a CT scan and it shows he's got a perforation of his intestines. Not good. Basically, he's got a hole in his gut and feces is leaking inside him. It was a pretty big hole and surgery was the only thing that was going to save his life. Anyway, his paperwork says he doesn't want CPR and he doesn't want surgery. So we put him on the end of life pathway and aim to keep him comfortable. No fluids, no antibiotics, basically a full withdrawal of treatment except pain meds. We estimated he had maybe 24 hours. I come back to work after a week of holiday and he's alive. Not just that, but he's also eating fish and chips. In just one week with no treatment, it looks like he's completely cured from a life-threatening condition. But literally a few hours later, he becomes unresponsive, has a cardiac arrest and passes away. The rally, the surge, terminal lucidity. There are lots of theories, but to be honest, no one has a blood.